Hi, Theater Mania. I am Geneva Carr, and we're talking about Incognito. I hope I see you there. Incognito is the latest play by one of the most thrilling young dramatists on the planet, and that is Nick Payne. Nick Payne is a is a genius. He uses the format of theater, I think, in this play really smartly to ask the questions the play is asking. Immediately you read this play and you think, whoever wrote this is an incredibly smart human being. It's like no other play I have ever seen, and it has a lot of humor. He is such a cheeky bastard that Nick Payne, I did not know that. The play is about, I guess, the brain, how much we know about the brain, how little we know about the brain. And the sort of conceit of the show is that f the four performers play about 21, 21 I think, parts between them. It's kind of a web of stories investigating the self, investigating the brain, and I think asking the question, uh, if we can find out what we're made of, does that give us more information about who we are? Uh, or, or does it actually serve to isolate us from other human beings? It's just a fascinating play about how we identify who we are, how we define who we are by brain function and by feelings, and are we our personality, are we our brain function? I think we all walk around feeling like we know who we are. We're not just our brains, we're not just our bodies, we're something greater than the sum of our parts. And this play is sort of questioning that idea, that we're, or asking, where is that? It's gonna take a few days for them to kind of process what exact, what glimpses they actually got. It, felt, it feels a bit like sometimes like a Christopher Nolan film, you know? Inception, you, 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 you're pretty sure it makes sense, but you just can't make sense of it yet. I sort of hope they just go and have a beer and talk about it, and that actually there isn't a single thing that, they can take away, but it, they might just sort of mull on it and ponder it. Once you sort of seriously consider the implications of what this play is sort of dealing with, um, it, it forces you to look at your life in a slightly different way, and I think that's, that's maybe one of the most exciting things a piece of theater can do, actually.